I've read quite a few different um, theories, and I, I didn't put it in these recipes, but I have it in the head notes for the book, about the origins of gazpacho. Basically, there are two completely separate theories that have nothing to do with each other, and I don't know which is right or whether they both happened at the same time. One is that the Roman legions, when they conquered that part, when they traveled on the road, carried with them their essential food, bread, garlic, salt, olive oil, and vinegar. So all those things are going to be in here, bread, salt, olive oil, and vinegar. But on the other hand, you have the Arabs, and the Arabs came from the south. What they brought with them was saffron, saffron which comes, originates in Iran, uh, almonds, so anytime you see a lot of nut-based sauces, that's all from the Arab influence. Melon could go in here, green apple, green grapes, which I do use, green herbs, so I have cilantro, I have mint, and it could be salad greens, lettuce, endive, and spinach, so I have spinach. So this one is made with garlic, grapes, and almonds. So you kind of have this, the meeting of the, the Roman influence, and the Arab influence in that one dish.